Hello, and welcome to a farewell tour of Glefsky. That's right, the Delamar system will be no more come patch 3.12.1, which will be coming out shortly. So we say farewell to Delamar and farewell to Lefsky. This video will be devoted to just touring some of the iconic places that we so enjoy in Lefsky. So we'll give it a farewell salute. Thank you for your service, Lefsky. This has been one of not only an iconic, but also most enjoyable locations in Star Citizen. So let's jump in and see what we'll be missing out. Now, it's not the end of the world. Delamar should hopefully reappear later on, but we shouldn't expect to be seeing it anytime in 2021. Now, there are a lot of theories and reasons why Delamar is being removed. I don't know exactly why, uh, but one contending theory currently is just the number of server assets. As we work towards iCache and server meshing, etc., um, the more places and assets to load put strains on strain on the server. Uh, and because of that, they're trying to limit content uh, to make gameplay and servers more stable. Now, one thing they are doing is introducing events and that'll be hopefully fun so we are playing in the live uh, but in ptu we've seen a lot of videos of xeno threat so we'll be taking on a bunch of that stuff as patches are released so we come into customs and we have admin and over here we have our trusty uh welcome to left ski panels where we can buy and sell and trade uh, so we'll miss this pretty nice over here when we first come up from the hangars before we pass through customs we have one of my favorite spots in Levski. Uh, and one of the things that they have mentioned is that assets um, or items that you can buy from Levski should eventually reappear in other uh, areas so we're going to go to teach a ship shop and take a look and save farewell now, there shouldn't be really anything new in this video. We're just going to see what we'll be missing and taking one last look before it all goes away. Teaches Ship Shop. We can run in here. It is nice. You can get down on the floor. We're not going to do that because there's a lot to cover. Uh, but yes, this is Teaches. We can get various ships. This is where I bought my Prospector from. At Prospy. I haven't been doing much mining lately, but we'll be getting into that in several weeks. So we're going to hopefully retrieve data. We know that Star Citizen is an alpha, uh, so there are still bugs and stuff. And it looks like the panel is not going to cooperate for us. There we go. Alright, so we have Anvil. We can get the Hornets. Argo. The oh, I MPUV cargo um, and personnel. So, this is a fairly new asset or relatively new asset over the last several months. From Drake, we have a bunch of options. We have the Buccaneer, the Dragonfly. I think all of us should have access to Dragonfly as of this recording for fun. The Cutlass Black, and I'm not sure why it's not rendering properly in the image. We have the Caterpillar. The Drake Herald, Cutlass Red, and Cutlass Blue. Yeah, we can't even see that one. Asperia, we have the Asperia Blade. Very scary Xeno fighter. The Prosby. I don't know why the rendering's freaking out so much. And then we have some RSI assets. We have the Grey Cat. We have the Aurora. The Aurora CL, this is just the Grand tra Brown Transport. And then we have the Cyclone. So those assets, I don't know if any of them are unique to just teach a ship shop. Uh, I don't think so at this point. Um, but we'll be missing this nonetheless. And I said I wasn't going to run down here. I just want to take a look at the ships because they weren't rendering right. Um, so we can remind ourselves. So we have the Auroras here. Uh, we have the Drake, the Cutlass Black, and I think we only have one Cutlass in here. 
This is the Prospector and the Hornet. So it looks like they don't have all the variants available. And this is the Buccaneer, the Glass Cannon. And then we have uh, some of the ground vehicles. So we say farewell to you. We should be able to still purchase those assets in game at various other locations. Now, Delamar, as uh, has always been stated, was never intended to be in the Stanton system. Uh, so the sincere hope is and expectation is that we will see Delamar and Levski um, in future content in another system. One of the reasons they put it in Stanton was really to test it out. They like this kind of contained, smaller scale uh, location that they thought was easier to manage. Um, and so that it was, I guess, hypothetically for testing purposes. Now, again, there are lots of contending theories out there. Um, you know, the, the, I think the front runner is, is that they need to put or reduce strain on uh, servers to ensure more seamless gameplay. If you've been playing in December of 2020, the servers were just unbearable. So we are going to say farewell to the living quarters We've woken up here many a times. One of the things I'm going to miss about Levski is that, to me, it's one of the most iconic locations because it's really got that gritty feel. And they've done such a good job with um, shadows, detail, feel, even sound. When we run around, you can feel like you're in a rock, the dripping of water constant. Um, it's just really really good ambiance and feel when you're running around. Um, over here uh, we have ore sales and we don't really have anything going on for us right now um, but we should be able to refine and do other stuff uh, when it comes back. So we're going to go um, down to the Grand uh, Barter Market. Uh, lots to do here. Uh, several shops will say Farewell to on our fair, farewell tour. If I, there we go. Look at that. It's just such a pretty location. I'm going to miss it. I, I understand that they probably need to remove it. And my hope is that with other content, it will become, um, you know, it won't be overly missed. And like even the shadow of the mirror, you can see Grand Barter in the reflection there. Um, just such such great detail and feel All right, so let's enter and we're gonna grab some water here. Looks like I'm getting thirsty uh, So we'll do that as we go I'm Gonna run in here but Before we go down um, Let's say farewell to stuff on this level conscientious objects Lots of fun stuff in here. I don't think there's anything particularly unique at this point in the game to Levski, so I wouldn't have to worry about um, purchasing anything specific in here. Uh, we have various weapons, items, and while we're here, um, Hi, we are to going to actually grab um, a med pen Good purchase. and an oxy pen. Okay, thank you, sir. And we'll just take a look here. We're not going to go through everything for time's sake. Hopefully this this loads right. Maybe. How do we get that other one to work? Hi. Good to have you back. Making progress. Got her. Okay. So if it's there, we go. All right. So we have some magazines. Attachments. Let's go to weapons, uh, and, uh, sniper rifles, missile launchers, some interesting stuff. And then utilities, we have med pen, oxy pen. Um, and then we have the sucker punch cannon for weaponry, uh, which we can attach. Um, so I think all these objects, like I said, or items we should Hi. be able to purchase to later back. on. Uh, so that's conscientious objects. We're gonna head out. We're gonna come over here.
run and check out a place where we can grab and hang out. The famous bar. We can do some back alley dealing. Let's see if this. He's up. I'm in the middle of something. All right. So he's busy. He's. I think he. He's sad that we'll see him go. And as we run around here, there's lots to explore if you haven't done it. Back here, uh, we have a little back alley room, um, some data pads, people hanging out, uh, you know, so we can kind of sit here, take a look, departures, um, some information. So farewell, little back area. Farewell, bar. We will miss you. All right, we're gonna go back out. And let's circle around. We'll kind of come, well, we'll take a look at Dumper's Depot. So we have Dumper's Depot here. Back here, and you can just hear like the water dripping the feel is great take another look um, you know again I don't remember anything being particularly unique I would always come here to purchase um, shields I think they still have some of my favorite shields for my Avenger and if we can get this to cooperate just have to be patient you get missiles um, mining laser heads propulsion, um, some decent ones here depending on what you're going for, shield generators, they have the FR-66, um, which is pretty good, the Mirage, which I like, I think those are the two I tend to default to, coolers, I mean it just, you know, they have basically everything you could want to really outfit, um, your your ship with which is nice so farewell dumpers depot in Levski. we shall hopefully see you one day again okay so i'm not going to get lost here we're going to go back to the grand barter we're going to grab some water to drink because i am getting thirsty so we're going to head down here now, one place I've always come, we have our little shop here where we can get mining helmets and equipment um, and stuff. Um, over here, we're going to unequip our helmet. I'm gonna do a quick buy. percent hydrated and now we're stuck so we're going to equip our helmet now over here uh, we can get the tiger claw oh boy we bugged out we just really like that bottle so that's unfortunate but again we're an alpha bugs are to be expected what would it be Star Citizen without a bug? So we have the Reauthorizer, the Walesco Reauthorizer, and Tiger Claw. Uh, we can use these to hack stuff, especially if we want to lower our crime stat. Super critical. And we're just gonna try to debug us by doing a salute, and that should have worked. All right, let's head over here. So this is gonna be the thing I'm gonna miss the most. And I am not sure where uh, Cordy's stuff is going to go. So, they have some super iconic gear um, that I'm not sure how and where it's going to be located. Uh, so, let me see if this renders properly and loads properly uh, so we can actually view it. Uh, we have a series of undersuits, but what really gets interesting here is some of the armor. Um, and armor sets. So nothing's more iconic than a helmet 
And I, let me see, did I just skim over it? One of my favorite helmets. I do like the G2, but Morningstar. Wow, they have a lot more stuff. I haven't, I guess, been here in a little while. Oh, there we go, the Oracles. I personally just like the look and feel of the Oracles. Um, and that's just my preference. They have some great stuff here. So there's some really interesting uh, items here uh, that you can purchase. And I am a little concerned that we won't get it. So I've stocked up on all the gear that I really like. Uh, but as we know, uh, if we reset a character or something goes wrong, a lot of that stuff can go away. So I certainly hope items um, are available in other locations. I'm personally sporting one of my favorite getups, as you can see. You can take a look. Um, and that just look and, and feel is part of what makes this game so much fun. Well, we're going to head out of here. And we're going to head over to some of the characters we can interact with and say our final farewell, and then we're gonna wrap this up. So I think I just took the long way around. Hold on, this way might be. Um, nope, I screwed it up. We'll go over this way. So we're gonna go to the innards of Levski, and this is where it gets super fun just to run around, dink around, and experience stuff. This is the inner workings of the mining colony. I'm not exactly sure what we would call it, depot, rest stop, what have you. And we're just gonna take a look, just look at it, look at it. Definitely a shame we won't be seeing a lot of this in 2021. I certainly hope it's reintroduced in 2020. We're gonna head over to the borehole station and look at this. We're gonna come over here, just uh, try to take a look down into the borehole. And we'll I think I've seen your face around these parts before. We get our fair bit of traffic, but I make a point of knowing who's who. What brings you around? Ah, then you'll be wanting to see me. Name's Reco. I see to the boring, fiddly bits for most of the miners work in the area. Dig site claims, equipment orders, or transfers and the like. For most jobs, the terminal will set you up. But if you're after something with a bit of air on it, Best to talk to me direct. If you'd like, I can see to setting you up with something now. Nothing too big, but it'll let us see how we feel about working together. Sound all right to you? Nope. Oh. Sounds good. Great. I'll take a scan through now. There may be a contract I could toss your way. And... Unfortunately, things are a bit slow right now. I'll keep you in mind if anything turns up, though. So there are missions that we can can take on, or there were there was one. Um, I don't know if I actually ran it. Now that I think about it, just because I I don't know if it was ever available and popped up. But that's uh, farewell to the borehole station and any missions associated with it. And we're gonna cap this off here shortly. And I took a wrong turn because we can go a little bit deeper. So there is some, some verticality. Central ventilation system. down there and 
still confused. Levski is a lot to it. There we go. This is where I wanted to go. Just doing our final tour, saying farewell, seeing the sights. Um, central ventilation. Just the scale, the verticality, the details. This game has come such a far away, such a long way. Still more to come, still more to work on. Uh, but I will say, uh, backing the game, honestly, it might have been five years now. I, I can't remember four, three, four, five years. It's been a while. And I have uh, honestly really just started enjoying the game over the last year and a half. Just given that there wasn't as much content. And Levski was a large part of that enjoyment. Just running around here, um, checking it out, enjoying it. Look at that, the rebarb coming out. Or I don't know what those are. Um, but yeah, Doug the Levski strung together with duct tape and hope. We say farewell to you. You've served us well. I know I've certainly enjoyed my time. Let me know what you think. What do you, what do you think about losing a planet, losing Levski? When do you hope to see it? Did you ever travel here? Was it even on your list of places you enjoyed? Please comment in the comment section. And I am actively trying to grow my YouTube channel. So if you do go on to enjoy this content and other content I post, please consider subscribing and dropping videos you enjoy a thumbs up. Thanks so much for watching. We're going to call this a video. And farewell, Levski. We'll miss you, and we hope to see you again. Shadow Coast out.